First, I will explain to you the break-even computation using the equation technique. All these things, we are uh, focusing on the single product first. Later, I will explain to you about the multi-product. Okay? So, uh, first, we are going to look at the equation technique. As mentioned earlier, uh, for the equation technique, you are looking at the sales or total sales less your total variable cost, less your total fixed cost, give you your profit. This is the equation that we're going to use to compute our break-even uh, break even point okay uh how you work out your sales that will be your selling your total sales that will be your uh, selling price per unit times the unit sold minus your variable cost per unit times your unit sold minus your total fixed cost okay that gives you your profit and this is the example just now we look at the selling price per unit 20 variable cost per unit 8 and the annual fixed cost is 60000 and currently we are produce, uh, producing and selling 80 uh, eight, sorry 8000 units so in cvp analysis we, we assume that the production equals to your sales i mean you produce it uh, you produce 8000 units and you sell 8000 units as well okay first i'm going to explain to you the equation technique how to solve this that means we are now what is it that we want to find we want to find the break even point we want to calculate how many units that you use you need to sell in order for you to break even means uh, break even means you are not making any profit and you are not making any losses that means at least how many units that we need should to, we should produce okay how many units at least we should produce if uh, anything below you sell something below that your break even point means you are making losses so we want to make profit of course when you do business you want to make profit so how many units at least the minimum quantity that we need to produce and sell okay that is called the break even so we want to find out at uh based on this example how many how many units is your break even okay using the equation technique currently you are producing and selling 8000 units you want to know how much is your break even so using the equation technique sales just now total sales less your total variable cost minus your total fixed cost gives you your net profit you work out your selling price per unit times the unit sold minus your variable cost per unit times your unit sold minus your total fixed cost gives you your net profit we have seen just now total sales less your uh, variable cost less your fixed cost gives you your profit so how to solve this equation so we know that at break even point net profit is equals to zero so net profit equals to zero and the unit sold is not known you do not know how many units that you need to sell in order for you to break even so you need to work out your unit sold so therefore the equation will become 20x that means your selling price per unit is 20 times the unit sold the unit sold is not known okay it is not known so we name it as x so 20x minus your variable cost just now your variable cost given in the question okay given in the question your variable cost is eight, uh, 8 okay your selling price just now is 20 so 20x minus your 8x uh, x sorry minus your 8x uh, minus your total fixed cost given in the question just now your total fixed cost is 60000 so this one given in the question your annual fixed cost is 60000 okay so minus your 60000 gives you a profit and as mentioned earlier net uh, your net profit equals to zero because now we are working at the break even point so your not net profit equals to zero once you have this you can solve the equation easily so 20x minus 8x gives you 12x okay 12x minus your 60000 equals to zero so you have your 12x now on your left hand side take your 60,000 negative bring to the right hand side that gives you a positive 60,000 so 12x equals to 60,000 now you want to work out for your x so 60,000 divided by 12 that gives you 5,000 units so that 5,000 units is your break even point so you need to sell at least 5,000 units to break even. That is when you work out your break even point in units. Another one that you can work out is your break even point in value or in 
RM. How much is your selling price just now? So your selling price just now is 20. Okay. So your selling price is 20. So you work out your break-even point in value. That will be 5,000 units times the 20 ringgit per unit. That gives you 100,000. So what is this 100,000? I need to sell 5,000 units to break even. And I will make 100,000. That is your break-even point in value. So anything below that. So if you are selling... So the company has to sell 5,000 units in order for the company to break even. Any sales below 5,000 units, if let's say you are selling currently, you are selling uh, 3,000 for example. If you are selling 3,000, that means you are making losses. If currently you are uh, producing and selling 8,000 units, okay, current sales. So your present sales is 8,000 units. So you, what do you think? Are you making profit or loss? Okay, so if you are selling above that, that means you are making profit. Anything below 5,000 gives you lost. Anything above 5,000 units gives you profit. So that is how you work out your uh, break-even computation using the equation technique. Okay, with that, I thank you.